can see me because I just messed up the camera when I was putting the battery back in but hopefully we're all good um, so yeah I've done my eyes off camera and I had to use mascara and I don't have eyelashes so if I look a bit like bowy eyelashes which I probably do look like I apologise because but yeah my mouth still looks a bit dark and like I said I'm not colour correcting because I'm just not I couldn't be asked to colour correct so I'm just gonna go back in a little bit more foundation around the mouth there we are and I just bounce it into the skin bounce bounce along bounce along yeah just bounce it into the skin like this get it all in there in there in there in there and again i can't remember what i was talking about because i'm so bad at multitasking but um for you guys that follow me on instagram snapchat twitter which you should all be following me on come on guys yeah you should be following me and supporting me on those different platforms but on instagram i do something called monday motivation so every monday i do a video i'm just still bouncing it into my skin guys but yeah every monday i do a video um just like i always say i haven't got it all figured out i'm 28 how much can you get have figured out in your only 28 years of living like, i'm only 28 yeah <laughs> so i haven't got it all figured out but there's some stuff i know there's some stuff i've been through and there's some stuff i've realized um so i just share like i literally listen and learn and there's a quote that Maya Angelou I think it is even said let me tell you the quote because I wrote it down the other day when you learn teach and when you get give and like I feel like I didn't realize I stuck to that mantra but I do so whatever I learn I want to teach and if I don't know it I'm not going to teach it uh, only when I know it and also teach things that I'm going through at the same time so I basically spoke about um you know preparation and just preparing and being prepared and um another thing that just being prepared for whatever basically be prepared for whatever you're asking god to do so go check it out it's on instagram um i'll put it out there on monday and another thing that i'm trying to do this cat is always wants a cameo you guys already know but another thing that i really am trying to do is um i'm trying to do like do just do not be scared not not be fearful um not talk about doing not read about doing like, I feel like I've watched enough, heard enough, seen enough, and, yeah, I just feel like I've done enough of that now, and now it's time for kind of me to do, um, yeah, my concealer, I like it quite close to my skin colour, and then I add a little bit of a lighter one, but, yeah, unless I'm going, like, I'm doing, like, a beat face, like, I just for every day I just think it's nice when I don't know I like to look like you're not like, oh Cass you're wearing foundation you know that that look like oh your skin like your skin looks so nice look hopefully I don't look like cake face that's what I want to look like I don't know if I look like cake face but I don't think I do um you guys can tell me below this cat it's so jarring. <laughs> yeah. So, um, yeah, I want to do, like I was saying, I want to do, 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 do. So that's what I'm all about. So even like with this get rid of me, honestly, like this is not something I can say I've wanted to do. Like, no, it's something I've wanted to do. Like I love fashion. I love I love, I love beauty, I love that kind of stuff, that's why I studied it, it's just that I'm not going to say I'm the best makeup artist or I'm the best fashionista, there's so many, YouTube is full of amazing makeup artists and amazing fashionistas and amazing everything and I just feel like I'm really good at encouraging, I'm really good at, you know, showing people that it doesn't matter where you've come from, you can get anywhere you want to, I'm really good at just, I've, I've got that personality, I feel like yeah, I can captivate you guys, I can talk to you guys, I can share my interesting stories and I'm good at that and I kind of want to stick to what I'm good at but I just like, you know, get ready with me, it doesn't have to just be all about my makeup, it's about conversation, it's about the stuff that I'm sharing with you guys and as much as maybe I think, oh you know, you guys could still learn something from me, I guess. <laughs> Do 
you know what I mean? And I'm kind of trying to be like, recently, I'm like, you know what? It's not about failing. If I put this video out and I get one view, I get one view. If one person learns one thing from it, one person learns one thing from it. It's not, like I'm just trying to, it's not about that. It's my why, my why isn't, my why never has been to have loads of people follow me for the, just for the sake of it. Like, there's no point of that, do you know what I mean? That's, no. and then um, I was watching something recently. Joey. I was watching something recently and it was just basically like, um, I was what like, it wasn't even a watching, I was watching something, it was an Instagram. And it was a post and a girl was just basically like, your, your, um, your woman empowerment lady only speaks to people with over 10k following, doesn't reply back to any of her, anyone that messages her and calls her friend bad bees. So I was like, you know what? If I'm saying that I want to inspire and you guys are being inspired, it's not even that I'm saying I want to inspire. That wasn't actually my goal. I don't know exactly what my goal was. It was just that I had a wedding, it went viral, and all right, now I'm on YouTube. Now we're doing YouTube. We didn't really have a plan for this channel. So I feel like you guys are kind of growing with us as well, if that makes sense. That like we haven't been here for like 10 years and worked it all out. No, this is all new. So um, yeah, so like I was saying, I was just like, you know what? If I'm saying that people are saying that I'm inspiring them, I need to talk to you. I need to learn, I need to share, like stuff like that. So yeah, I'm not really worried about failure at the moment. I think failure, fa there's such a thing as failure. I think you learn and that's what I'm trying to do at the moment. I'm just trying to learn, I'm trying to learn more about myself. So yeah, I'm learning and I'm enjoying learning. Put it that way. I really am enjoying learning. Then I go with a lighter colour, like I said. Um, yeah, so it's not about subscribers as much as I love you guys. Um, and I love everyone that watches and I appreciate. And I've literally just started going through the wedding video and there's 22,000 comments and I'm going to try and get through every comment. So every day I've said I'm gonna put an hour aside to literally message everyone back and thank everyone for actually even watching um, and being part of my journey. Cause I appreciate it. And I guess I wouldn't, I wouldn't have this platform if it wasn't for all of that. So I'm just trying to be grateful and say what I'm grateful for and stuff. So yeah, like I said, if one person learns one thing, one person learns one thing. If two people learn two things, two people learn two things. But yeah, I just don't, don't be scared of failing guys. Don't be scared of what people are gonna think. Don't be scared of what people are gonna say. Don't be, you know, I, that's not your worry, that's not your concern. The more you don't do, one thing I've realized is the more that I don't do is the more I don't learn. I don't know, like, you know when it's like, oh, oh, I wish I could, you know, um, I don't know, there's so many things that we say we wanna do, it's like, oh, like, if I had the money, yeah, I'd do this, but, okay, you might not have all the money right now. Oops. My, yeah, you might not have all the money right now, but what actually can you do towards what, you know, like, what can you do towards whatever you say and you want to do? And then when you actually do it, you might actually realize that, you know what? I actually hate this. People say, oh, I wish I could start a YouTube channel, but I don't have a camera and I don't have a this and I don't have a that. But what if you start, you buy the camera, you buy the light and then you don't actually want to be on YouTube. Why don't you just start, start with whatever you've got, whatever's in your means and see how you feel and if you actually enjoy what you're doing. So me, guys, you're going to see me try. So like, I think I'm even, might as well call it try with Cass. Try, let's try things together, guys. Like things that I'm really passionate about. I was talking about it with Peter, the one that's always in the videos with Carl. Like, yeah. What am I passionate about? I'm passionate about women. I'm passionate about young women, young girls. I'm passionate about, I'm even, I'm not even young women, you're just, I'm passionate about all women, to be honest. That, you know, we can be whatever we want to be. I'm passionate about encouraging. I'm passionate about movies. I'm passionate about music. I'm passionate about getting a message out there. I'm passionate about helping people to see that it's not so easy to get from A to Z. Yeah, so let's try different things, man, together. And fail and fall down and then get back up and try something else until one day something will actually work. You know what I mean? 
Mm -hmm. One of them, you'll be like, oh, my days. And I love, to be honest, I was thinking about it the other day. This is the bit that I really don't ever get right, but hey, this is like contoury kind of stuff. And I feel like my contour's a bit light. That's the issue. I need to get a darker one. Um, these are like ColourPop. I really like them though. The ColourPop concealers. Um, yeah. The ColourPop concealers. But I actually love the ColourPop concealers. They're so... The only thing is I just feel like the colours some that are a bit... Some of them are a bit orangey and some of them are a bit light. Um, so they're not perfect for... Oh, like I kind of have to kind of mix some sometimes to get the right color. But you saw me; I used two color pop. I've used the color pop concealer first. That's kind of close to my skin tone, so that wasn't bad. Blend, 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 blend. Um, yeah, that always find like Carl be like, "What's that on your face? Like, your face is dark there." But it's like me trying to contour. <laughs> so. I'm trying to learn to blend, so I probably just have to sit here and just talk to you guys and do this for long and get it all blended in. But yeah, I can't remember what I was just saying because I've got the memory of a flipping fish. But um, just yeah, failing. It's okay. It's okay to fail. It's okay not to get things right. We don't have to be perfect. I think I'm always, I used to be so concerned with what people think. So like, even like all my videos will be like, oh that video got 20, but that video got none. I remember um, Mimi and Alex Icon, my faves, I love them so much. They're such help to me and Carl in so many ways. But I remember Mimi was just like, um, to me, they're YouTubers and you guys probably know them. But yeah, they're huge YouTubers. But they, she was like, don't really care about the views. Don't worry about that. And like literally, like I, I, with this video, I'm like, get ready with me. Who wants to really see that? But I'm not too worried about the views, man. I'm just, just let's just do this. Yeah, she said, when you worry about the views, that's the video. Like, when you're like, let something go viral, that's the thing that just never goes viral. That's a rubbish thing. But when you just do something because you want to do it, because it resonates, because you feel it, those are the things that people actually, um, those are the pe things that people actually can relate to. So, yeah, I'm just trying to do those kind of like relatable I'm looking at the monitor just because I don't know, I can't see myself. But yeah, I'm just trying to do anything that I feel to do, I want to do on this channel. For now, I'm going to do it. So yeah. Um, that was a bit much. I use my beauty blender for everything as well guys. Like literally use it for everything. I don't really use brushes. I use a beauty blender. But um yeah, so failing together. Tell me guys you guys tell me what you're trying out. What new things you've like in the comments below let me know what new things you've started or you know something that you've been really scared to do and will smith said something he's like on the other side of your fear is breakthrough like and that touched me it was like everything you're scared of doing it's like what if you just did it and then i, I put a post up on twitter the other day everything that you speak about and everything that you say you're gonna do imagine you just done everything you said you was gonna do like we'd get a lot further like i could have started probably doing youtube before the wedding really um I had spoken about it before. Do you know what I mean? Obviously, there's perfect timing. I, I get that. But, yeah. On the other side of fear is breakthrough. One thing as well, guys, um, that I've done, and now, I wouldn't say I regret it, because you learn. Remember what I was saying about, I don't think there should be, there's no space for regret, but there's, just learning about my smile lines always go funny so after I put the powder under my eyes I kind of push the powder into my smile lines just to yeah kind of get that right but 
yeah, um, and he was just like, what was I saying? Um, yeah, one thing that I'd done. So, I quit my job. I got really gassed, obviously, when social media first kicked off for me. And me and Carl, financially, Carl was in a good place. Um, I was doing hair from my friend's salon um, that she owns. And yeah, I was really, in, I thought I was gonna enjoy it because I love hair care. I do love natural hair and I love natural hair care. So, and I learned how to like, I had been doing that stuff before as like a side hustle. But then what was happening is a lot of people was coming to meet me to do their hair, but they were like from you, people that I, people, people that follow me basically. And it was more about like, they wanted to catch up with me. And I don't mind it. I didn't mind talking and stuff like that. There's nothing wrong with that. But it's like not every, you know like, there was times where I'd go to work and I just kind of want to have a quiet day or I'm not really feeling all bubbly and loud that day or, yeah, and it's like, I felt pressure to be always that person. Pressure to always look right, pressure. I just had felt so many pressures, which was, some of them you could say was quite silly. Um, yeah, so I kind of stopped promoting it, which is bad. And then, um, and then her salon closed because she's getting a new salon, so I had no money. And in hindsight now, I'm just like, Cass, you didn't have to quit your job because you was only working two and a half days. Um, and like, yeah, Carl does really help me and I'm really thankful and our rent's paid and all of those things are sorted. Um, but... Yeah, all those things are sorted. And I always have to do this, wipe off my earrings. Um, all of those things are sorted, but at the same time, like there's certain luxury things that I wanna buy that it's just like, it's not affordable right now. And being a YouTuber, being an Instagrammer, all of that kind of stuff, I just feel like sometimes we, we rush into things because we're like, oh, no, you know, I need to leave my job and I wanna do this or I wanna do that. But I don't think, I feel like, that my job was financing everything I was doing, if that makes sense. Like, my job was paying for the fun stuff that I got to do and yeah, now I don't have that, it's just a lot harder and I'm not actually making any money at the moment, which is really difficult. I was looking for my lip gloss, but I can't, my lip, I can't find it. But yeah, I'm not really making much money. It's, yeah, it's, it, it can be frustrating, um, but, yeah, so, I'm getting tongue twisted. If you guys know of any social media jobs, I'm not too proud. That's one thing with me. I'm learning not to be too proud. Any social media jobs, anything you think I'll be good at and you're in the UK, email me, CassandraLocco at gmail.com. Let's get to work. Let's finance all the things that I want to do. Yeah. But there's a lot of exciting things that are actually coming that I'm working on at the moment. Um, there's just things that are not gonna generate hundreds of pounds right now, basically. But, yeah, so in hindsight, so guys, I've basically kind of got a natural lip line, lip liner, um, on my lips, so. what I do. I put the mat just because like there's like concealer on my lips a bit of like I mean foundation so I'll put like one of these this is the NYX liquid suede in color 4 LS LSCL4 you can see it but yeah I put that in my lips and I just back that together just to give some colour and I don't know if you can see but my lips look lined because I've got like a black actually black rim around my lips oh there it is what I was going to use this is this NYX soft cream matte lip this one probably just use a little bit in there it's a bit lighter not even a lighter, but this is it. 
pink up. And I use that in the inner bit. My lip. See? I don't know what that looks like. And then, this is Rimmel Oh My Gloss. I don't know what colour this is. Sorry, guys. It's just called Rimmel Oh My Gloss. It's like a pinky colour of a shimmer. My lips look a bit dry though. They've been a bit, yeah, they have. I don't know. They've been a bit dry. They have been a bit dry. Oh, I forgot. My phone, it looks like the battery's gonna die, so if it cuts out, yeah but yeah this is just this has been fun guys it's been interesting it's been hard it's not been easy doing this but it's been fun and i use um i literally one of these colors i use this one to actually highlight now it's a bit darker than i don't know i just kind of like the way it looks you guys you'll see it in a second yeah so i literally get it on the corner of my highlighting brush i don't use blush or anything and, on an everyday look and I just kind of I make it kind of a C shape I've been seeing that recently not too much just on the can you see I don't know that kind of looks a lot <laughs> yeah it kind of looks a lot but I never get the two sides right, by the way, but hey. It's like I'm left handed, so it's like I never get it completely. Does it look right? I don't know, guys. That one looks a lot right, and that one looks a bit more subtle. I don't know. It looks alright to me. And then. I like to use Studio Fix, but I can't afford it right now because, like I said, I don't have a job. So we gotta be honest. So I use MUA. This one, I don't think it's it's a pro base fixing mist. So it's just a fix mist. I just go my face like that, and then it's done. Um, I need to do my baby hairs, but I will do them off camera. Um, yeah. But this is kind of my get ready with me. I'm not gonna get dressed or anything. I'm most probably gonna wear this and some leggings. But yeah, thanks for watching and just thank you for being part of my journey. Honestly, I, I'll say this all the time, but I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful that I'm even able to document, not just for even me. I'm, I'm, I'm happy I'm able to document for me, but I'm happy I'm able to document for my kids in the future, that they're gonna be able to see this and see their mum's journey. And I'm happy that I'm gonna be able to look back on this in however many years and be like, wow, I've come far. So thank you. And just let me know what you guys are doing. I love to know, I love to help in any way I can. And yeah, we're on this journey together. I keep saying it's a partnership. It's not just me, it's us, literally. Um, as we grow, um, as things change in my life, as things change in your life, um, yeah, let's do this together. And I love you guys, man. Um, thank you for subscribing. I told you to subscribe earlier. If you haven't, subscribe, like, comment. Like, just share. Let's do this together. Love you guys. And see you again soon. And I hope you like my makeup. I don't know. I do, what, do they, what do YouTubers do? And they're like... <laughs> no, I can't take myself seriously. Sorry. Yeah, I'll get there. I'll get there. Not there yet. But yeah, love you guys, man. See you again soon.